please can you like the video and subscribe to the page and uh, yeah follow my career and any updates and reviews and anything I do I'm gonna try and mix it up and do some different things with different athletes and stuff like that so feel if you subscribe to the page it's gonna give me the motivation to um, keep making like good content just about to head down to St. Joe's this morning now for some sparring. Um, hopefully there's going to be some good names there and I can give you an update about who I'm in with and stuff afterwards and uh, help me move forward towards getting in with these better guys and I want to start travelling about a bit if um, I can't get a match then I might as well just try and mix it with these bigger names so when the time comes I'm, I'm ready to get up there like and uh, yeah I'll um, keep you up a day after after I come out of the sparring and tell you how it went. So I just got back from sparring and there was good news and bad news. Um, the good news was that I didn't get hit once. Bad news was they cancelled the sparring. <laughs> but um, I still got 10 rounds of training in. Um, it's great to train around world champions like Lee Selby. Um, and the boys who were boxing on TV for the first time, really hungry. So it was a nice session to just be around them. I'm really enjoying training at the minute and um, stepping up my sessions again towards the end of this week. Uh, yeah, I'm just wanting to get back into sparring really regular now. So after this show in Swansea is out of the way, um, I think my regular sparring partner will be back to it. And um, yeah, I'm going to really push on and aim towards November, even though I haven't got a fight lined up yet. I'm just going to get myself in a really great position for it. So um, keep watching, I'll keep you updated, and uh, yeah, don't forget to subscribe.